G'day everybody, welcome back to another episode of Crafted by Tim. Today is one of those cases where I need something so I'm going to make it um, to avoid, you know, having to pay for stuff. So let's make a scoop for, for no reason at all. There will be a reason but you won't be able to find out until much later. But these things are great. So firstly I'm going to start off by cutting off a bit of material. to make a 30 degree cut on the scoop end to make it more scoop like. Well, whilst that's drying, I've still got some cherry left from uh, the last two projects. Um, the notepad and the archery box. I think it's cherry. I, I don't know what else it could be. It smells like cherry. So, I'm going to line this up a bit. Now I'm going to just trace out the back. I'll cut this out on the bandsaw and then we'll get to gluing this on as well. Eight mil uh, diameter hole, roughly in the centre-ish. I mean, if you can take the time to actually mark out where the center is, it's probably better if you do that. Wow, that's off center. Whatever. And fits an 8mm down. Now I'm just going to turn down the hand. good that I decided to wear my, uh, my, my Japanese safety boots. My feet hurt. Excellent. Okay. As always, wipe away the excess. What I'm going to do is I'm going to clamp this up now. So just finished cleaning this up with the um, bandsaw, took up a little bit around the edges. Now I'm just going to clean it up with the um, lasher. Okay. Now all we got to do is 
clear this up. All right, there you have it. That's it all done with a uh, nice coat of boiled linseed oil on it. Um, if you wanted to use this for like sugar or flour or something like that, it would be better to put um, a food safe oil on it, such as... What's food safe again? Um, vegetable oil. Vegetable oil would finish this up really nicely. And it'll make it food safe. You could use flour, sugar, um, corn, like popcorn kernels, corn kernels, just anything like that. Rice, even, be really good for. Um, and you can also make these fairly precisely to about a cup or about half a cup or something like that. You just have to do the maths around it, and it wouldn't be too difficult. But anyway, I think that's about it for this episode. Um, mine I'm going to be using for borax. Or I would be. There will be a video about this. I think next week. I'll be able to get one out to you guys. It will be more of a vlog than anything. But I'll explain what's actually happening. Um, but for the end of this video, that's it. Done. Pretty cool project and I finished it in about a day, so easy one day build. Anyway, as always, thanks for watching and cheers.